The government of Niger says a military unit tried to seize the presidential palace in the capital Niamey overnight in an attempted coup, but it was pushed back and order has been restored. The assailants from a nearby airbase fled after the presidential guard met their attack with heavy shelling and gunfire. Government spokesman Abrahaman Zakaria said several people had been arrested while others were still being sought. A military unit has attempted to seize the presidential palace in Niger's capital, Niamey, a security source said on Wednesday, just days before handover of power. Early on Wednesday, the sound of heavy gunfire echoed through the capital streets. That was the assailants being pushed back, the security source said, adding that order was now restored. Three other security sources said the rebellious unit from a nearby airbase had fled after the attack was met with heavy shelling and gunfire from the presidential guard unit. A search is ongoing. The sources who spoke on condition of anonymity did not comment on the whereabouts of the president-elect Mohamed Bazoum. He is due to be sworn in on Friday after an election victory that was disputed by his opponent, former President Maham Usman. The inauguration marks the first democratic transition of power in a country that has witnessed four military coups since independence from France in 1960. Both attacks by Islamic militants and protests have increased since Barzoum's victory in the presidential runoff in February. Usman says the vote was made by fraud. In pockets of the capital on Wednesday, his supporters took to the streets for a shadowed protest. Police fired tear gas, according to witnesses, who also said roads out of the city had been closed. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.